Welcome back, everybody, to Bramble the Mountain King. Let's dive back into this story, shall we? And get a little recap on what just happened. That's right, we escaped the troll by the power of sunlight. The little note here, watch his, his shoe. Like that's, that's just a great little thing. Like his shoe comes out a little bit. Like they didn't have to do that. Ule was comforted by the morning sun. He had survived the night, but just barely. At least he had found the stone again. And it felt like it was his sister's way of telling him he was on the right path. Yes, to properly do it the way my channel. Welcome back everybody to the next episode of Bramble the Mountain King. Make sure to like and subscribe if you have not already. Well, let's jump into this game. Ah! <laughs> Alright, so the last episode got pretty dark and gruesome. Um. There's a number top. Didn't know how to swam. Such a reprise to the purity that this game can have. I can explore this area. Give me an achievement for this. Find the Nachen figure. I mispronounce a word. I apologize. I'm not fluent in whatever language this game is set in. I don't know if it's Swedish or Dutch. I, I just don't know. If any of you do know, let me know. I do love to learn more. I'm, I'm very open about the fact that I'm ignorant to some things in life. I can't know everything. Nobody will. Um, but if I can learn, if someone's willing to teach me, I'm glad to learn it. Now, what folklore is this coming from? One singular combination. Like, I know a lot of folklores have trolls, but, like, is this a specific folklore's troll kind of thing? Is it German? Is it Swiss? Is it Swedish? Is it, um, uh, I doubt, I don't know if it'd be Russian. The language doesn't sound Russian. Is it Nordic? Is it... I don't know. Let me know. 
because I didn't even read the the synopsis to this game. I was like, I think I got this and the Fox Spirit game together for like four dollars, something like that. I said, you know what? I've heard good things about these games. I'm just gonna buy them for four dollars for both. So you can definitely expect to see that Fox Spirit game someday as well. Because I mean, I'm sorry, are you guys, are you guys, are you people? Oh, bless you. Uh, another giant. Hi. You want to be friends? Maybe I need to get one of these to him so he sneezes or she sneezes. Yep. Hello. Oh, are you the same one? Are you Lem? I love your hat. Why don't you have legs? Bye. Oh, look how happy they look. Oh, what's wrong, little guy? What's wrong? Oh. 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 So trusting. <laughs> they must not have seen what happened last episode in the grotesque pit of grotesqueness. What was I up to? Oh, they got little butt cheeks. <gasps> Look at those butt cheeks. If you become a member on this channel, you can get a butt cheek having mushroom. I know, sounds weird, but you could have it. And it's a door, it's an emote. You could use it in the comments and whenever I stream live. I love how the thing like loses its balance so it has to grab on from time to time. Here you go, oh. Grandpapa. <laughs> 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 Yeah, that's right, you get that hat back on. Oh. <laughs> I love this gnome thing. Is this gonna be like a Grig or something? A Grig is a cricket like fay that plays a violin. Some kind of fay trickery. So you know, they're gonna ask for a shrubbery. <gasps> well, we got her stone, that's good. Oh, okay, so I can just hold it, very good. Ooh. Well, I was gonna say, well, which way do I go? Now I know. Zombies? I didn't sign up for zombie. I mean, I didn't sign up for a lot of this. Huh. Huh. I thought I was gonna have to like do like a swing, swing it kind of thing. Break it. Wait. Okay, there's no gnome in this one. So that looks safe. I'm gonna get a closer look at these creatures.
feel like having a light source out with bats there is a bad idea. Oh my god, they move. Uh, sorry, I've had bats in my house. Never happened till we moved to Iowa. Apparently just something something we have to get used to. So now when I see bats, I'm like, ooh, about that. Not the biggest fan. I used to be like, oh, let's watch videos on how cute bats are. Not anymore, Jack. Okay. Coming on back down. I don't know if I need to do that. Oh, it looks like it does affect this game's physics is impressive. Gotta go fast. Kind of, not really. I'd like to see more of them. I mean, from afar. Very much. Who are you? Like some kind of imp or something? Just leave him there. I was just waiting for like one of their heads to pass by. Music brought the people. Wind push them down. And he ate them. He buried them. I'm only a little scared, okay? Oh, no, not again. Naked lady who plays the violin, please don't notice me. Ugh. Yeah, I was like, can I go up there? Looks like no. Oh, you guys are here, huh? Guess she doesn't mind them. They're probably. go over here oh I thought that was her hand waiting for us <laughs> let's go take a look that's something I can pick up no it's just grass in his teeth idiot what you get for being a jerk Been around in that background for our musical lady. Wish the Frog King were here.
Yeah, look at your hands. It's a lovely hand you got there. Nope. Um. You're still following me. Almost went towards that water. That's right, you just go back to playing your instruments. I was not fast enough. Want me to hide behind this? That's fair. So it shows you what to hide behind by what it's impact, so I can hide behind this one to the right. Good visual cues are good. Okay, tree. Oh. Maybe I needed to crouch. Oops, I'm dead. Uh, that was me just being impatient. That there was a roll. Nope, don't do that, soul. Don't do that. Yeah, okay, I just need to duck. That is completely fair. Okay, so I need to wait for that to come around. That's understandable. It's not about going fast, it's about going at the right time. Close ears, boy. Let's get behind this tree. Woo! Almost out there! Whoa. We still doing this? Are we stealth? We are stealthy. I'm not here, sir, ma'am. Really not sure what you are. But you are terrifying, so you got that going for you, which is nice, I guess. them. In his past life, Nekin was a simple man that loved playing his violin, but the village did not appreciate his talent. People would frequently bully him, 
And the only soul that did not was a girl that Nakin fell in love with. One day, the bullying and beatings became so severe that Nakin's anger finally overtook him. Blame him. He marched into the village, playing forbidden melodies that made everyone dance until their flesh and bone got worn down. They eventually died. Leaving behind shuffling corpses, still trying to dance to Nekin's melodies. The wanderers down where we were running through. His love was not spared death either. Devastated, Nekin left the town and lived by the lake, drowning in his sorrow. Where he still lures people with his deadly music. We get another thing? No, okay. Because with our first book, we got extra dialogue when we looked at it. Ooh, look at that shadow. Ooh! That's good. Man, they put a lot of detail, a lot of attention into the detail of these shadows. Sunlight. Oh. Nakin gonna be back? Ooh, that's moving fast. As a good friend of mine would say, and then water effects, mate. I don't know if you can fail this, but I'm not going to try right now. Survive against Nakin achievement. We were oddly saved by Nakin. <sighs> Gotta give him the will to get up. Put the X button. So neat how the indicator moves with us. Here again? Looking quite as pretty as it used to. Sister gonna be at that archway again. I 
still have the stone. That's good. falling apart. I hope I didn't just die. Yay. <laughs> I mean, like a naiad or something? back he gave it back and cleaned Tuva us. Tuva was a light in the darkness. She had filled his heart with courage and the stone with her radiance. The bramble covers all where darkness has taken hold, Tuva said. Follow the light. You will find what you are searching for within the mountain. Ooh, there's that dead body. All right, folks, that's going to be it for this episode. Um, I'm basically just trying to go on what appears to be, you know, normative stopping points or segments for this. Um, originally, I was going to do, like, hour-long episodes, but this feels more right. So it does look like I need to turn on the light as well because, yeah. Thank you all for watching. I hope you continue to enjoy this as I am. Do take care of yourselves. But until next time, bye-bye for now.